How bold are you when it comes to supersizing your business? Are you as bold as brass when supersizing your business, the topic of growing and building and creating what it is that you want to see in the world? Our idiom, Sharon Hornell from here, our idiom for supersize your business today is confidence related and it is as bold as brass. As bold as brass describes someone who exudes extreme confidence, somebody who uh, is brazen or very forward. Uh, this comes from the Lord Mayor of London in the 1770s, but also appeared in a 1608 pamphlet criticizing the Jesuit priests for being bold and too bold in many people's opinion. Now again, just like anything else, bold and bold as brass, and if you're too bold or not bold enough, is a matter of personal opinion and objectivity, right? We get to decide what's too brass or too brazen for us. Uh, we've all met people who are extremely confident on the verge of cocky and egotistical and arrogant. And I think there's a fine line there and it's up to each of us to walk that and decide what's right for us and the business that we're creating in the world. Uh, but we have to be bold in some ways. We have to be confident and believe in ourselves because if we don't believe in ourselves and the business we're building, nobody else is going to believe in it either. We're not going to be able to, to bring people in as team members, as strategic partners, or as customers if we don't have 100% confidence and belief in what it is that we're creating. Uh, we can be bold as brass when it comes to uh, sharing other people's stories and experiences with us and our company and our organization and the things that our systems and processes and procedures our business does for people. What problem does it solve? How does it make their lives better in some way, shape, or form? And if it doesn't, is that really a great business model? We have to ask ourselves that as well. But we need to be confident in every area and aspect of our business or attract people that are confident and competent and uh, excellent in different areas and aspects of the business in order to supersize and grow it. So like I opened with, my question for you today is, are you or how bold are you when it comes to growing and building and supersizing your business? On a scale of one to 10, 10 being got it all together, super confident, know I'll figure it out no matter what, 10 or one, two, three. Mm, I'm just starting out, I'm just figuring it out, I'm not super confident yet. Fastest, best thing you can do is personally develop and get that confidence and that comes from doing what it is that you say you'll do, being competent, being optimistic, being positive, knowing that and believing in yourself that you'll figure it out no matter what comes your way. Because I guarantee stuff is going to come up that you never even imagine when you're growing and building a business. Have an awesome day. I will be with you tomorrow with another confidence-related idiom to coincide with the 365 BU challenge this year to do one thing every day that improves us. And guess what? The best way to improve your business is by doing one thing every day that improves you and makes you a better human being. All right, have an awesome day. Any questions, hit me up. Otherwise, I'll be with you tomorrow. Bye.